All right, 1012. Yeah, breaking news right now in West Haven. Reports are two people were killed in an explosion, a steam explosion of some kind on the campus of the VA hospital on Campbell Avenue. Still working to learn if anyone else was injured in this. Fox 61's Aisha Bo on scene right now. Aisha, what are they telling you right now? I know they backed you up as well. Are they? Is this still a threat at this point? Yeah, this time uh, we are still being asked to stay where we are. Uh, I did see multiple cars leave at this time, so it looks like uh, some fire trucks and ambulances have left, but the area is still blocked off. I just want to step aside and give you an idea of the area where this explosion happened. Again, at this time this morning, we can confirm that an explosion is what authorities are responding to here at the VA hospital in West Haven, and there are reports that two people have died as a result of that. So again, we're Working to get as much information here, but we know that this was as a result of a steam explosion and it happened at a building on the back of the campus here at the VA hospital. And at this time it is being investigated by both local and state authorities. We also know state police, they are on scene assisting with this investigation. Uh, and we've been able to see multiple authorities just walking around that area that is concentrated back there. I also saw multiple ambulances leaving when we arrived here earlier this morning, which was about an hour ago uh, as we were trying to get more information here for you. We don't know just how many injuries there might be, but again, we can confirm that two people have died as a result of that explosion. Now we are on the scene. Uh, we are working to get you more information as much as we can. I've also been told by West Haven police that they are working to get us someone from the hospital there uh, from their public affairs department to come out and give us an update on what is happening here. Uh, but again, we know that two people have died. One is a VA employee and the second person was a contractor. So again, that area is still blocked off and it doesn't look like authorities are leaving anytime soon here. Uh, again, we are being asked to stay where we are um, and we are working to get you as much information as we can here from the West Haven uh, VA hospital here. But for now, we're live. Aisha Bo, Fox 61 News. Back to you. Aisha, thank you. And we do also want to mention we also have Tony Terzi on scene right now. We'll hopefully get a live report from him in a little while. He has a different angle, getting a little bit um, more information. He's saying that this happened, someone confirmed to him that this happened in building number 22. As Aisha mentioned, that's on the back half of the campus and that this happened during maintenance. Again, as we've been hearing, uh, this has unfortunately been confirmed to be somebody who was a contractor yep. doing that maintenance and another VA employee there. And Tony is also reporting there's no further danger at this time, but what he's doing, he's heading over to Yale New Haven Hospital, try to get more information there. So, of course, we're going to stay on top of this breaking news.